Jr. Focus Winner. Today's first message is run your own race. Hebrews 12.1 And since we are surrounded by such a huge crowd of witnesses to the life of faith, let us strip off every weight that slows us down, especially the sin which so easily trips us up. And let us run with endurance the race God has set before us. Philippians 3.14 I press on to reach the end of the race and receive the heavenly prize for which God, through Christ Jesus, is calling us. Again, today's message is run your own race. Too often, when I travel around the United States and locally, people admire me and admire others, and they want to pattern their life to be like my life or to be like other people's lives that they admire. But I'm telling you today, God has uniquely created you. You are a masterpiece to God. God has uniquely created you to run your own race. So there's no need to replicate. You must separate yourself from others by running your race to win at all times. But it's your own individual race that God created you to run. You don't have to copy anyone else's lives. You don't have to be envious of anyone else's life. Because God has uniquely created you to run your own race. Now be careful. Don't wait for the particular race you think God has chosen for you. Don't give a half-hearted effort if you're in the minor leagues. Oh, I'll wait until I'm in the majors and then I'll run my race to win then. God is carefully observing your behavior to make sure that you run every race to win. And then, when you run the race that's specifically designed for you, God will ensure that you win that race. But you must run every race to win. So don't be envious of other people. Don't be competitive with other people. God has uniquely designed you to run your own race. Get out there and run your own race.